Okay, so what's your plan? We're not going to go to the first gray dock or the second gray dock, but the third dock with the white rubbers. I'm going to have to be in reverse at some point. I'm going to try to hit it at about 20 degree angle. Yep, yeah. or we don't have any boats on our way, so less than 20 degrees would be ideal. Yeah. Now, gonna... I feel the wind's moving the stern to our port. Right. Okay, look and see where the steering wheel's pointed. Okay, that's good. Good call. There you go. Good, good. And the wind's pushing, so you'll have to do a little bit more reversing than you expect. This is easy. Okay, may put this yeah, the starboard and forward to bring the stern over a little bit. Now the port in reverse to bring the stern over some more. And you just have to seesaw back and forth and back and forth until you get close enough to the dock. But this is good for a touch and go. Let's get out of here and do a U-turn and come back and do it again. Now I'm assuming that white ball has an anchor under it tied to the back of that houseboat. Right. So we have to miss the white ball. Are we touching the dock? No, but... Okay, we're going to kiss the dock. Neutral, our fender's in place. Okay, if you want to get out of here, put the stern over to the, put the bow over to the right. Okay, neutral, starboard reverse. Now both reverse. See how we're angling away from the dock? So both reverse, so we're going to escape backwards upwind. Well, the wind, when you're Opposing the wind, it's an asset. When you're going with the wind, it gets weird. And of course, we've got to watch that sailboat that's anchored over there, too. You're doing good. It was good, cool, calm, slow, no excitement, easy as pie.